Hi everyone, so in this video I'd like to review the Casa Brutus uh, magazine that goes through Japanese architecture and this is an amazing magazine that just has so much information on uh, Japanese architecture. So let me just go through some of the pages. So Japan is well known for what they call Miyadaiku and what that is is it's architecture that doesn't use any nails at all in their buildings. And a lot of the temples are made that way and some of the older Japanese homes are made that way as well. So there's a lot of that introduced in this magazine as well. Uh, but there's, it goes in detail through all the different parts of the houses. So the posts, the pillars, uh, the walls, the ceilings. And as you can see, there's all sorts of traditional Japanese houses or possibly former castles, gardens. It actually goes through some temples as well, what the temples look like inside. It introduces some famous artists that talk about their famous, uh, favorite architecture in Japan. And in the middle, there's this little booklet that introduces uh, 50 plus 10 uh, Kyoto traditional architecture. And this actually hasn't been opened in this copy, so I won't be showing you what it is. But um, it's a great little addition, especially if you plan on traveling to Kyoto. And everyone that comes to Japan uh, travels to Kyoto, so this is a great way for you to uh, have a unique map to travel Kyoto. And the book is generally, or the magazine is generally in Japanese, but there's a portion here that is actually in English. And so, yeah, so seven steps traditional Japanese architecture and design. It goes through seven different steps. And they talk about some restaurants that have amazing architecture, as you can see. Beautiful gardens. And just some how some houses are built. And more details. So that's Casabrutus, Japanese architecture. Thanks for watching. Have a good day.